All right, so I'm just making a quick video kind of explaining uh, senders and receivers and how you can kind of set up like a animation to play whenever someone like touches your nose with a finger or like head pats you or something like that. Um, so right here, I've got a receiver set uh, set up that essentially whenever a sender collides with it, uh, which it's a finger sender. Um, then it will update this parameter that I made called nose boop, which is just a float in here. Uh, it will update that value to one. And so whenever that's updated to one, I have different things set up. So like this purring is turned off whenever the uh, float is below 0.95, but when it goes above 0.95, it will turn on this purring animation, which essentially turns on this audio source. As well as down here, I have um, this setup so that when head pats is above 0.95, it will trigger this happy face animation that I have set up. And I also have something set up for some tail logic, but it's the same thing. You just you set up head pats or whatever float you're using greater than, and I just use 0.95. You can kind of use whatever you want. Uh, but once it's above this point, it will trigger the animation to play. And whenever the sender exits the area, so whenever the sender exits this area, it will then set the value of the float back to zero because that's the default value. So I can show you here. I have the sender right here set up i just have this mimicking a uh, hand and a finger so that i can just test things out and so whenever it collides it causes a face to play and the tail here and then you pull it out and it goes back and same thing for the head for head pats it speeds up my tail animation drops the ears down and it plays a happy face and purring as well pull it away and it stops and so you can just set this up to interact with like fingers that are already built in so you don't actually have to set up a sender yourself unless you want to set up some custom component uh, to, to send a signal to a receiver um, but that's the basics here pretty much for senders and receivers uh, from what I've messed with so far just to make like an interactive like booping or head padding uh, setup